Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another video. It actually snowed pretty much the last couple of days. Also, this is our special guest today. Good morning. Robert. Robert is very well equipped once again, as you can see. He's one of the best equipped guys I know. <laughs> and yeah, what's today's plan? As you might know, I recently got my GTR back. And so today's plan is to take that out in the snow. Before we do that, however, I want you to realize how beautifully cleaned and fresh my GTR looks. It got cleaned by Glanzworld in Munich and honestly it looks like a completely new car, especially on the inside. Just look at it. You even cleaned the floor mats and everything. Yeah, so my plan today is to change that and to make the GTR look used and ugly again like most of my cars. Robert is motivated I think. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> yeah, as soon as Robert shows up it started to snow, it's just crazy. Look how beautiful. Yeah, by the way, look what I got in the mail yesterday. Ah, beautiful. Yeah, this is thanks to you guys. We fucking made it. First milestone. Yeah, so let's go. Yeah, so the funny thing is, Robert's seat is all the way to the top. <laughs> well, my seat is all the way on the bottom. If you look at the car from the outside, you see Robert nearly touching the <laughs> ceiling and me nearly sitting on the floor, which is perfect. Yeah, let's go, Robert. Let's fit. Let's fit. Yeah, so before we start filming, we're gonna go grab something to eat really quick, maybe fill up the car. Also, just listen how nice the straight cut gears sound. I love it. It's like a race car. So now we're strong and healthy again. I got a 360 camera and I kind of want to try it out today. So I think we're going to mount it really quick. And this car looks so good. I fucking love it. <laughs> I think my car is now twice the length than it normally is. <laughs> so I really have to be careful with the GoPro. Sometimes happens with the GTR if you slide too much. What you do normally is just. And we're back. It's a really easy fix. I hope it works. Honestly, the GTR is just so nice to slide because most of the power goes to the rear wheels. So it kind of feels like a rear wheel drive car, like the M3, for example. couldn't get up the hill where well, I drove up with my GTR with ease <laughs> or maybe we can help him let's find out okay so they can't get up the hill it's two young girls <laughs> I don't have a tow hook with me so I'm just going to try to drive their car up the hill 
Maybe it'll work. <laughs> Snow chains, mounting, you still have everything last. I'm oh. happy that, that I don't need snow chains. Yeah, the problem was I didn't have a tow hook with me. <laughs> Normally I always have a tow hook, but today I didn't. But luckily they had snow chains. I've never mounted snow chains in my entire life before. Yeah, if you need snow chains, I can mount them for you. Oh, yeah. Perfect, we made it. <laughs> yeah, so we successfully rescued the girls. Now we have <laughs> to do one victory donut and then we can go to the next spot, I think. <laughs> yeah, we need to fuel up really quick and also clean my windows because my wipers are like the worst wipers you've probably ever seen in your entire life. Good old 98. Hey. Yes. Voilà. Hey. Theoretically, I would need 100, but whatever. Honestly, one of the coolest cars you can buy. It can do everything. It can drive in snow, it can go fast in a straight line. You can take it to the track, you can daily it. I took it to Ibiza, or actually Saint Tropez, two years ago. So you can also go on holiday with it. Perfect. <laughs> may not have fucked up my front pump a little bit down here <gasps> that's a bit annoying because oh shit <laughs> yeah, i think i need to loosen this screw and then we should be good yeah maybe if we're lucky maybe they have the tools here at the gas station so i can just unscrew that and it won't scrape on the ground anymore <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so those guys just helped me demount my splitter from my car so it doesn't scrape on the road anymore and now the car is good to go again. They were actually really nice guys and really happy to see me and they took the part of the splitter that I lost with me uh, with them so <laughs> yeah at least now they have a souvenir from my GTR which is perfect. <laughs> yeah we're gonna go grab something to eat now and then we'll see if we can make some flames in the evening. In general I think now it's going to be pretty cool with the flames. <laughs>
have some problems and now I have to plug in this device which can help me hopefully read out <laughs> I'm a chief mechanic <laughs> I don't get paid anything for that I actually lose something if I do that mm -hmm. ah so my shift fork is stuck perfect oh, you don't know. Oh, I think my shift fork actually really is stuck. I'm a chief mechanic. I kind of feel like this is not going to solve our problem. <laughs> the problem what happened actually was that I just downshifted and the car, although it was not good for the car, the car downshifted as well. It sometimes happens with GTRs. It happened to me once before, that was like three years ago. And today is the second time that it happened. Yeah, so Robert, I hope you enjoyed my <laughs> video. Yeah, it was great. Yeah. Okay, so here's a quick update for you. Uh, the car drives, but only in second, fourth, and sixth gear. I don't have reverse, I don't have first gear, I don't have third gear, and I don't have fifth gear. There's a little, it's called fork, which basically just pushes the single gears into action. And this fork uh, broke. It's a very it's actually one of the most common GTR problems. I've never had this problem with my GTR, honestly. It's still my first fork, so yeah. Now it finally happened. It's a bit stupid that it happened now, but yeah, at least we can drive home. Oh, but without reverse, so that's going to be quite interesting as well. Yeah, at least it's snowing now. <laughs> After one hour of driving in a fucking whatever it's called in English, now we have to push the car into the garage and look how much it snows now and my car is not working i swear to god it's never snowed that much the last couple of weeks oh yeah it is what it is let's push it back Cars back in a garage. The video ended a bit differently than I initially thought, but everything's all right. It's just a small repair, uh, at least I hope. Yeah, then the car will be back soon, very soon actually, because I'm taking it to Finland, like I already said, in a few weeks. I hope you still enjoyed the video. Here's a little edit for you, made by the man himself, if he's motivated enough. <laughs> so I see you guys in the next video. See you. <laughs>